Good afternoon, children. So, we are in lecture number two. And lecture number two. Lecture number two. Chapter four. Organize. Now, take your textbook. In this topic, I have to make you understand. I will write all the points on board, but it is to be marked now. And writing whole textbook on board is not possible. So I will write all the keywords regarding that points, so you can easily understand. So let us go back into vision. Of 
this loop pair activity goes in sequential order and how step by step result is delivered so we can reach to the final destination so when you decide all this thing in a sequential order in a chronological order it is called clarification of objectives what is your objective to do such activity and apne jota hoy school ya our objective such hai okay bar bar teacher no objective such hai okay bar 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 to aa bhi vastu je chhe mani to ke tera pandemic ma tera bhu je aap aap hota hoy sarkar no je log de ne guidelines pass karti hai acha so that your objective such hai
આ બધી વસ્તુને કમ્બાઇન ટુ કરે બરાબર હવે વોટ વોઝ માય પોઈન્ટ છે ડિફરન્ટ ડિપાર્ટમેન્ટ ઓફ ડિફરન્ટ ફંક્શન બધા ડિપાર્ટમેન્ટને પોતપોતાના ફંક્શન કરવાના હોય માર્કેટિંગ ડિપાર્ટમેન્ટ વિલ નોટ ઇન્ટરફિયર ઇન સેલ્સ ડિપાર્ટમેન્ટ સેલ્સ વિલ નોટ અપિયર સોરી ઇન્ટરફિયર ઇન કન્ઝ્યુમર કેર ડિપાર્ટમેન્ટ હા ઇફ નેસેસરી દે વિલ ટેક ફીડબેક બટ અનનેસેસરી દે વિલ નોટ ઇન્ટરફિયર સો વોટ ઇઝ માય ફોર થર્ડ પોઈન્ટ સેઇ બાય ડિફરન્ટ ડિપાર્ટમેન્ટ ફોર ડિફરન્ટ ફંક્શન ધીસ ઇઝ માય થર્ડ પોઈન્ટ ઓકે સો માર્ક અપ કમ ઓન ધીસ ઇઝ અ લોંગ પોઈન્ટ યુ આર સપોઝ ટુ માર્ક વોટ આઈ રીડ સ્ટેન્ડ યોર પેન કમ ઓન once the list of functions are prepared the work area similar in nature are classified means work is separated distributed chale kya hai classification but agar ye gun vyapari lave to ya ki gun nahi beche de ene sorting out kare mota bate da kare nana kare bate di kare sari ke labe pach kare pachhe sorting kari pachhe ben se that is called sorting out right so this then the division of work is done accordingly work is divided as per purchase area sales area account area that means how much you can make the whole picture of it actually marketing department sales department administrative department consumer care department purchase department manufacturing department kada bada depends on size of your unit right the division is planned in such a way according to nature of unit geographical area etc a bada department na division che functions che e geographical unit pramane plan tha eno area pramane bada plan tha koi divas tumhe jo sales department ke administration department bega ho be nu ulu judu hoy ke be nu working criteria judu che production department ne marketing department ko bhi bega ho marketing head of staff hi tha to to production manufacturing plant ma bhi tha Understood? So this is how they are bifurcated. See, the division is planned according to nature of unit, geographical area, and working area. For example, the division of business unit selling products in entire country, zone-wise division of sales for South East West zone are made. Take for example, Hindustan Limited Limited chain. You know, how many more multinational companies? તો કે હિન્દુસ્તાન લીવર લિમિટેડ ને એક કારખાને દે કે ઇન્ડિયા માં માલ સમાન પહોંચતો હોય નહીં પણ પ્રોડક્શન સપોઝ એક કારખાને માં થતું હોય તો ડિસ્ટ્રીબ્યુશન ઇ ઈસ્ટ વેસ્ટ નોર્થ સાઉથ સેન્ટ્રલ અથવા એની કે તા આ બાજુ નોર્થ ઈસ્ટ નોર્થ વેસ્ટ નોર્થ વેસ્ટ એવી રીતે ડિવિઝન કરી દે હવે ધારો કે આપણે ગુજરાત છે તો ગુજરાત ધારો કે વેસ્ટ રીજન માં હોય તો આપણે વેસ્ટ રીજન કે ઉપર હિન્દુસ્તાન લીવર નો માલ સમાન લાવવા માટે અને ઈ લોકો પછી ગુજરાત ને સેન્શન કરે કે વેસ્ટ રીજન માટે સેન્શન કરે કે એટલે ઈ ચેક એવરી ડિપાર્ટમેન્ટ ઇઝ સ્પેસિફાઈડ વિથ અલોટમેન્ટ ઓફ સ્પેસિફિક વર્ક સો देयर ઇઝ નો કન્ફ્યુઝન ઓર કમોશન અંદર અંદર કે તાન થાય ને કન્ફ્યુઝન થાય નહી રાઈટ સો ઇન ધ સેમ વે ધ ધ ધ વર્ક બેઝ ઓન ડિસ્ટ્રીબ્યુશન એઝ પર એડવર્ટાઇઝિંગ ટાસ્ક પેકિંગ ટાસ્ક ડિસ્ટ્રીબ્યુશન ટાસ્ક એન્ડ સેલ્સ ડિપાર્ટમેન્ટ આલસો કન્સિડર ધ ટાઈપ ઓફ ડિવિઝન ઓફ વર્ક રાઈટ આ દિસ વાઈ ધ ફોર કે કોલ બિઝનેસ યુનિટ છો બિઝનેસ યુનિટ છે તો એક એડવર્ટાઇઝિંગ ડિપાર્ટમેન્ટ હોય બરાબર એડવર્ટાઇઝિંગ ડિપાર્ટમેન્ટ હોય એ કાર્ય ડિપાર્ટમેન્ટ હોય એડવર્ટાઇઝિંગ જ કરતો હોય રાઈટ સેલ્સ ડિપાર્ટમેન્ટ છે સેલ્સ ની માથા કુટ કરતો માર્કેટિંગ ડિપાર્ટમેન્ટ ઇઝ અ માર્કેટિંગ જ કરતો હોય કન્ઝ્યુમર કેર ડિપાર્ટમેન્ટ છે સતત કન્ઝ્યુમર ની કમ્પ્લેન્ટ ફીડબેક જ લેતા હોય આ બધા ડિપાર્ટમેન્ટ જુદા છે આ બધા યુનિટ છે જો યુનિફાઈડ બોલાતી કામ કરશે તો જ રિઝલ્ટ અચીવ થશે ધીસ ઇઝ કોલ્ડ ઓર્ગેનાઇઝેશન બધા વર્કરો જુદા છે ઓર્ગેનાઇઝેશન બધું કેવું છે એ જ છે માર્કેટિંગ કે સેલ્સ ડિપાર્ટમેન્ટ જુદા છે પણ માણસો એ સેમ જ છે એટલે બધા એક આમાં કામ કરી આમાં એમ એક બીજા ને કનેક્ટેડ છે સેલ્સ વાળા છે પાછા મિશન ડિપાર્ટમેન્ટ ને કનેક્ટેડ છે શું કામ કે એની જરૂર પડતી હોય આને આની જરૂર પડતી હોય ધીસ ઇઝ હાઉ ઓલ ડિપાર્ટમેન્ટ વર્ક્સ ટુગેધર કોન્ટ્રીબ્યુટિંગ ટુ ધેર ઇન્ડિવિઝ્યુઅલ એન્ડ ધીસ ઇન્ડિવિઝ્યુઅલ કોન્ટ્રીબ્યુશન રિઝલ્ટ્સ ઇન ટુ સક્સેસ ઓફ બિઝનેસ So what was my third point? Different department for different functions. Right? Can I give a complex division of labor? Now we are shifting to point number four. Right? Point number four. Okay. Point number four says to determine departmental position and abilities. Point number four says to determine
departmental post and their abilities. Abilities. Whatever to determine the departmental post and their abilities. Post and their abilities. Okay. Now see, every department is different. Every departmental head is appointed at every department level, and each and every department has to fulfill their duty in different way. That is called their abilities. Sales department जब वो काम करते हुए, जब वो डिपार्टमेंटिंग कर रहे थे, उसको करते हुए, तो ना जो मार्केटिंग वाला है कितना बदले काम करता है? मार्केटिंग वाला जब वो काम करता है, जब वो डिप्रोडक्शन वाला है, जब वो कुछ करता है, तो ना डिप्रोडक्शन वाला है कितना जुड़ी रहते so ultimately, आम बता जुड़ा चाहे, आम बता पेंगा चाहे। That means to determine departmental post in their abilities. Okay? So let us see. Once the work is determined, sorry, department is properly. एक बार जाने बता ने पोर्ट को तरह department सौ भी दिया हुआ है क्या? The task to have proper persons to handle the responsibility are created as position and abilities are applied accordingly. Right? So. Different task, different task is given at different level. Why? To handle all the necessities. And when all the necessities, right? And the department. प्रबंधन आप भी एक भी ऑफिस में जाएं तो ऑफिस में तो मैं जो एक एक पोस्ट ना बता मार्च सोल्डी होता बंदी पोस्ट ना मार्च सोल्डी है क्लर्क हो या हेड क्लर्क हो टीम हो या चपरासी हो स्वीपर हो या मैनेजर हो बता आओ जो अतः बदल में बहुत पोता नहीं रहते पोता नहीं वो लाता चे अने ये लोग को ये नहीं प्रबंधन for example, sales officer for sales department, right? At the same time, the sub post and categories are also created. Kali sales department, I mean sales manager example, I put you. But sales department one, right? Department. But head call one, sales manager, right? Manager. But any other thing, we have 25 jana kam karta ho. Ye ko aap do kam kya karta ho, right? But aap apne aap ke liye bhi jab 25 jana kam karta. So this is how work is distributed. It depends on the size of unit. Every one one person is five jobs, every one person is five hundred jobs. Because we have unit size to handle what is needed. That means to determine different department post and their abilities. There are head of department and head, and each head is subordinate, and each head is subordinate, and each head is subordinate. This is how linear quality work. Right? So now, a different task is given to all different level, vendor all the rest. Level number one, level number one, no can't go. Level number two, level number two, no can't go. Level number three, no, level number three, no can't go. Finally, what are you going to do with the change? Okay, sales manager, departmental head. Right? So this is how it is working out. Our fourth point. Number one, fifth point. Fifth point, right? The delegation of power and responsibility. Once again, the same point. The delegation of power and responsibility. What are we at? I have a point of it. Chata up there. जो इसे बहुत डिप पड़े जाए, पर फिफ्थ पॉइंट अंडरलाइन कर जो आपको इम्पोर्टेंट पॉइंट है, डिविजनल हेड्स, सब डिविजनल हेड्स एंड स्किल बेस हेड्स आर फाइनलाइज्ड एंड देन ऑल द हेड्स शुड बी गिवन प्रॉपर पावर एंड रिस्पांस सो दैट दे कैन परफॉर्म दिया वर वेल, बराबर चेक, हम लोग के सोती पर एक और व 
वाला टारगेट है सब डिविजनल है सब डिविजनल है बराबर एनी विच में जाकर क्या हुआ जाकर एनी विच में जो पांच जना सबॉर्डिनेट है बराबर एनी विच में जो पांच जना है बराबर है तो दिस ऑल पीपल आर सपोज्ड टू फंक्शन अकॉर्डिंग टू देयर एबिलिटी एंड स्किल ये लोग जो काम कर रहे हैं जो रिस्पांसिबिलिटी फॉलो कर रहे हैं ऑथोरिटी को लेकर जो डिविजन है राइट और ई काम यो पहले क्या प्रेजेंट कर रहा हूं डिविजनल हेड है सपोज दिस पीपल रिपोर्ट टू दिस दिस पीपल रिपोर्ट टू दिस अथवा दिस पीपल रिपोर्ट टू दिस और दिस टू दिस और दिस फाइनली ही इज रिस्पांसिबल फॉर हिज डिपार्टमेंट राइट सो दिस इज अ डेलीगेशन ऑफ ऑल ऑथोरिटी पावर इज डन नो सी इन एडिशन टू दैट क्लेरिफिकेशन शुड बी डन टू ईच पर्सन पोस्ट so that each person will get the idea of the responsibility assigned har ek manas ne potal pramane clarification karu pare jo bhai aa tari jawabdari che aa tare karvano che clarification bhale kari din hoy to fari bhai mai karavu pare su ka ke ni pramane ch kaam karu parse right so it is necessary to have proper proportion of power and responsibility koi department ne vadhare power ane ochi responsibility कोई डिपार्टमेंट ने ओछो पावर ने बदल रिस्पांसिबिलिटी बदल है पावर एंड रिस्पांसिबिलिटी मस्ट बी बैलेंस गाना मारे ने दाई बात ना करे दाया मारे ने गाडी बात ना करे समझो तू दो ना की जितनो प्रोपोर्शनल रिस्पांसिबिलिटी हो ये रोज प्रोपोर्शनल पावर हो जो जितनो प्रोपोर्शनल पावर है इट्स प्रोपोर्शनल रिस्पांसिबिलिटी सर तो आज के उस काम था इट मींस डेलीगेशन ऑफ पावर एंड रिस्पांसिबिलिटी राइट चेन बिजनेस मोटर यूनिट वाले बदल डायरेक्शन कर बदल दिया the reporting proper and appointment then appointment goes to the board of appointment and final comes to the department head and all the two department head goes to chairman of the department means this is how that unit works ab do mai tumne chapter number 1 ma samjhe right now our sixth point our sixth point 6.6 point establishment of interrelationship thank you establishment of inter relation right establishment of inter relation that means all departments are different you see all departments are different that means different one different what is assigned Sixth point. After proper 
distribution of wealth, the delegation of power and responsibility among different departmental personnel, the formation of internal relations should be made clear. Who is responsible for who? Who will report to who? Avanti was to do kaam karu pare. With this, with the help of departmentalization, the power and responsibility are decentralized, but at the same time, they are centralized to form an interrelation. So, kaam ke bandha department juda juda chale. That means power and responsibility are decentralized. Ek bhi jab koi baat ho, badi baat mana. But each samay. अच्छा बता डिपार्टमेंट बेगा चुके हैं मींस दे आर सेंट्रलाइज्ड राइट सो दिस इज आवर सिक्स्थ पॉइंट नाउ वी आर कमिंग टू सेवेंथ राइट नाउ वी आर कमिंग टू सेवेंथ सेवेंथ पॉइंट से टू प्रॉपर और टू प्रिपेयर ऑर्गेनाइजेशनल चार्ट टू प्रिपेयर प्रिपेयर ऑर्गेनाइजेशनल चार्ट राइट
means different department for different work. Different department for different work. That is called departmental functions. Then comes to position in a departmental position and abilities. Departmental position and its abilities. Then point number five says delegation of authority and responsibility. And responsibility. Six says interrelation between different departments. Between different departments. And seven point six. Prepare organization chart. So these are the seven points which says steps for the process for organization. Once again, I say clarification of objectives, list of functions, departmental functions with different departments for different work must be made. Four, departmental position, their abilities and their capacities. Fifth, delegation of authority and responsibility to each and every individual department. And interrelation between different people. But the department should not change. Now, what are they Means communication, right? And finally, now what do you know? A chart will be formed. So, like I have written, preparation of one universal chart. And this chart means what is more like a specific job. Like I have said, and every employee is required to write. That after that, our work is done. After that, when the work is done, the work is done. Okay? No, no mismanagement. This was my second day. So, can you go about steps for process of organization? Page number 37, textbook book number 2. Chapter 77, point 10, Lida. Right? In third lecture, this was my lecture number 2. In third lecture, we will start with structure of organization. Remember, we will start with structure of organization. That will be my lecture number 3. So, am I clear, children? Okay? Aji refer karo beta, no subject, but dupa do school yao shakya samjha means, like tere, go pop karo. But abe, eh, toh joh, bane kya hundi lak toh jau chun. Bolo in bittu, tumne samjha, tu jau chun. But abe, chen, abe, toh abe, toh kriya, toh toh chai. Anu, tumne material, what are problems? And this is how we will work. Okay, children, till then, goodbye, take care.